Hello everyone, I'd like to start with a moment's silence for an old friend of mine, the patrol console. Oh, how it used to help me out in the old days. It used to give me direct access to my agents. I could see what was being collected. I could do basic diagnostics. I could run commands. I could run PSL directly on the agent. TrueSight does have a way of running PSL on the agent, but it's just not the same. What if we could bring back all the functionality of the patrol console? into TrueSight. Well, good news, Sentry Software has done just that. We've recreated the patrol console. Here we see, again, the patrol tree. We can see what's being monitored. We can even see the information that used to appear in info boxes. This console also works with non-Sentry KMs. Here we see the Linux operating system KM. Under storage, I can see that one of my file systems is not mounted. So let's quickly get rid of those thresholds so that I no longer get this alert. If we click on thresholds and disable the two alarm thresholds, I will no longer see this in my console and I won't get alerts about it. If we look back at the top here, we can see that there are a lot of hardware faults being collected. Let's just double check if the appropriate events are also being generated. If we select event origin of MSHW, make it a regular expression, and look for events that are not class 11. Here we can see a whole bunch of hardware events being generated. So the KM is working and generating events, so somebody should be actioning them. So let's look for some nines to see if anybody is actually fixing things and the events get closed. I can only see a single class nine here, so it doesn't look like anybody is actually actioning these events. Oh well. I'll look into that later. Let's check out what else we can do in this console. If we go under tools and debug, we can turn on the patrol agents debug. We can even download those debugs directly to my PC. We also have a command prompt. Here we can run basic commands or even run VI and other more advanced command line utilities. Under tools as well, we have a PSL programming area where we can run PSL directly on the agent. If only I could remember how to write PSL. This GUI is also available through the TrueSight presentation server. So far we've been accessing it directly on port 3443, but if we go under manage devices in the TrueSight presentation server, where query agent used to be, we now have a direct link to the monitoring studio GUI. There is also an extension of the TrueSight API, where we can run patrol REST queries. We can also run REST queries directly to the patrol agent. If you're interested in what else Sentry has developed recently, please check out our other videos. We've got a video on green IT, the new views and GUI for the hardware KM, the monitoring studio GUI, and a video about creating monitoring studio templates. Thank you for watching.